Hello again and welcome my math friends. So today we are going to talk about how do you add when you have three numbers. So we're looking at three add-ins when we are finding the sum. And remember the sum is the answer to an addition problem. And the add-ins are the numbers that we are adding. All right, so let's take a look at our very first problem. We have 2 plus 4 plus 6, so we have three add-ins. Now, there's no one exact way that you have to solve this, and that's very important for you to understand. So I want you to think back of the strategies that you've learned so far, like counting on, using friendly facts, making a 10, or doubles. So let's take a look at what we have. For this strategy, I am going to go ahead and um, I'm going to make a 10. Let's make a 10 first to start with, okay? So I'm going to take my 6 and my 4, I'm going to put those together, and I have 10, right? Then all I have to worry about is adding 10 plus 2. And I can do that in my head super easy. And what is the answer? 12. Very good. Now let's think of another way that we could do that. Okay, I could put my 4 and 2 together and that gives me 6 and then I have doubles. 6 plus 6 still equals 12, right? Very good. So I also can move my add-ins around. If I wanted to add 6 plus 2 and then count on, so 6 plus 2 is 8, and then count on, I will still get 12. Are you with me? Very good. Let's take a look at another one. All right, so here we have 5 plus 4 plus 4. Again, I could go straight to seeing my doubles. I see a 4 here and I see a 4 here. So let's pretend that we're going to start with the double strategy. 4 plus 4 is 8, right? So 4 plus 4 is 8. Well, 8 plus 5 is a little bit of a challenge for me to do in my head. But if I really wanted to start by using doubles, I could then move on into my make a 10 strategy. And I could, what's that fancy word when we break apart a number? Decompose. I could decompose this 5 to be 3 and 2. Then I take my 8 and my 2 together. What do I have? That's right, I have 10. And now all I have to do is add 10 plus 3 in my head, right? And my answer should be 13. Very good. Well, what if I wanted to try a different strategy? What if I wanted to do 5 plus 4 first? Because that's a friendly fact for me, and I know 5 plus 4 is 9. And then I just need one more here, because I know 9 plus 1 makes a 10. And I just have to add three more, right? I still end up getting what? 13. Excellent. Very good. Well, you did it. You did a great job. Thank you for watching. And I can't wait to see you add with three add-ins tomorrow.